Our glorious leader Putin has just shot a rare Siberian tiger with a dark gun. Surely he is at one with, connected to, master of, nature at its most fierce. And look, look, our glorious leader Putin has just spoken fluent goose to some rare migrating geese as he flies adjacently to them in a light aircraft wearing a beak leading them to safety just as he metaphorically leads our nation with a cool, authoritative dignity. Look now, our glorious leader Putin has just woken up and thumped out 200 loaves of dough in a masculine and serious way to be baked for the starving old people. And look, look, a crowd of beautiful women sing how they wish their boyfriends were as conscientious and as traditionally masculine as our glorious leader Putin, as they shake their feminine behinds respectfully at his motorcade, silly girls. And wow, look, our glorious leader Putin has been diving in the sea with his shirt off, showcasing his masculine figure to his country and the world as he finds some ancient artefacts in the seabed again. And bravo, our glorious leader Putin throws a lesser man in judo. Woof, our glorious leader Putin rides a horse masterfully with his shirt off. Listen, our glorious leader Putin is laughing at a joke, displaying to our country and the world that despite possessing an overall masculinity of impregnable steel, he is able to laugh at an authorised joke somebody has made in line with the concerns and beliefs of our glorious leader Putin. And see, our glorious leader Putin has just masturbated in the shower, in line with the recommendations of the Ministry of Healthcare of the Russian Federation. After all, he is nearly only a man, for which this is ordinary behaviour. Observe now how our glorious leader Putin cleans his penis after with a Q-tip, so tidily and neatly, as if he were erasing a small secret from his past as a KGB hero agent. And now our glorious leader Putin is drinking a glass of his own delicious and superior vodka brand Putinka. Surely there is no other vodka brand currently available on the market that typifies the drinking requirements of an actual Russian man. And imagine that as our glorious leader Putin swallows the cold, hot transparency of it, he opens his ears to himself and hears not one dissenting voice from within thusly closing the wound of each of his thoughts with the same brute salve of his sure and ripe reflection.